Following her engagement to Prince Harry in 2018, Meghan Markle announced her resignation from the television show Suits. Before she became a household name, Meghan Markle achieved success on the big screen and got her breakout role on the hugely popular legal drama Suits, which airs on the USA Network. The Duchess of Sussex portrayed the role of Rachel Zane, a paralegal, in the film that was released in 2011. She rapidly became a fan favorite due to her intelligence and her love for the protagonist, Mike Ross, who was played by Patrick J. Adams. Following the conclusion of her six-year service, Meghan became a senior member of the British royal family and became a full-time member of the royal family. This occurred as a result of her relationship with Prince Harry becoming more serious. In addition, she appeared on Deal or No Deal as a briefcase model and played a raunchy part alongside Dustin Mulligan's character Ethan in the television show 90,210, which originates from the CW. Despite the fact that Suits was canceled in 2019, the show has continued to achieve unprecedented levels of success which has led to the assurance that it will return in the future. Megan's highest paid part was on the television show Suits, where she reportedly earned a remarkable £37,000 each episode, bringing her yearly compensation to an astounding £333,000. This is despite the fact that she has played a variety of characters. It is possible that the 42-year-old may continue to benefit from the ongoing royalties that are associated with the show on account of its continued success. She has also been in the films Antisocial and Horrible Bosses, both of which were released in 2010, as well as Remember Me, which starred Robert Pattinson. The sum of £1,380,000 that she made from her brief cameo as a barmaid alongside the Twilight star was attributed by many to her previous marriage to Trevor Engelson, who was the producer of the picture herself. The Mirror reported that Meghan's net worth was a staggering £5 million, which can be attributed to the numerous television and film credits she has received. She was compensated £11,7,000 for the short film The Candidate and £11,4,000 for the independent feature The Boys and Girls Guide to Getting Down. Following their departure from their positions as senior royals in the year 2020, Meghan and Prince Harry reportedly were able to purchase their Montecito property with the assistance of the money that she earned from her acting profession, although her full acting wage is unknown. According to reports, the pair has a combined net worth of more than $60 million, with Meghan reportedly donating an estimated $2 million towards the purchase of the breathtaking house.